like, share, subscribe. Um, yeah, I'm here. I'm here to talk about um, Draymond Green altercation with Jordan Poole. Um, everybody know that Draymond says he's walking away from the Warriors um, from for for the altercation because he because they somebody uh, put the camera I mean put the video tape on them him just stealing on dude for no reason um everybody know him and Junior Poole been having tension for the whole season of last year Draymond been getting in his face right Getting riled up for no reason because he's trying to pull. He the awful dog of the team. He the man. Uh, without them, without him, it won't be no Warriors team. That's what everybody keeps saying. Um, they keep praising. Um, Draymond is the man. And even Steph Curry and um, Clay Thompson believe it. I don't know why, but... They give it all to him because he hold big man, hold defense on big man. That's what y'all say. And um, pass the ball to them. Whippy do. But the point, he didn't, everybody had their opinion on, on, on what happened. And let me put my little um, two cents in. Um. It's unnecessary. Um, Draymond, everybody already been saying his contract extension is um, going to be coming up. And Jordan Poole and they, everybody got this friction and tension on that. That uh, the Warriors don't know who, who they going to pay, but everybody knows. Is looking more towards Jordan Poole because he had an amazing season last year. I don't know how much he averaged and probably was around 14 or 18. Probably around those number of points. But ever since Draymond of his first starting um Ever since he started over, um, what was that, David West or David Lee? I think he took David Lee drive. He was playing good. And after those few years of him, it seemed like after you get LeBron and his, his stuff, he been not been able to shoot threes. That's why had all his poise of him being useful for the team. Now he don't do nothing. And I don't care what nobody say to keep saying, comparing him to Dennis Rodman, and he's this great defender. I don't really see him do nothing. He hold him, hold him for a few minutes, then he done. Like everybody else that hold their players, but they still they call him a defensive stopper, but he he has some the defensive presence a little bit, but he's not that great to me. What people praise of his defense, he he's he's okay. But the point, um, uh, my thought of the end of this conversation, um, Jordan Paul gonna get that money. He already know that, and Draymond, he know he finna be off the team, and they finna um, get rid of him, because they already know they don't need him no more. That's why he's so mad at this dude. He can't stand him. That's why. That's why he yakking up, riding his voice at dude every minute, because he know he at the door. He, he, that's why he made a podcast and everything. To get his attention and get his frustration off, because he know his job finna be taken. Everybody keep talking about Draymond is this and that, but he ain't 
he's this and that a few years ago when he's able to shoot threes. Now he can't do nothing but pass the ball to um Stephen Curry. And that's sad. And you can pay all that money just to pass the ball and set screens to um Stephen Curry and, and not do nothing. All he do is bark and put his breath in people's face. But um that's my opinion from the video. Like, share, subscribe, and I'm out.